Can you help me understand what's going on here, Tess? Brooke, you don't have to tackle these issues alone. Issues? Maybe I don't have any issues. Maybe this is just my fucked up personality. Here I am, ladies and gentlemen. A drunken rat like you're still living like he's 15. Look. Will you go and make an appointment with the GP to talk about your underlying health conditions and the alcohol intake? Or well, well, go and see the occupational therapist that I booked in for you. Look, no one needs to no one needs to know how buying him this could be totally confidential. <laughs> you know, I didn't have so much as a cigarette until I started working in. I mean the most I'd ever had to drink was it was half a shandy. You were a child when you first started working here. Yeah? yeah? We all change as life throws obstacles at us. We experiment. We grow up. We move on. That, that's totally normal. You know, if you were a part of it, they didn't want anything to do with you. Like you had to, you had to drink like the boys. You had to smoke like the boys. You had to, you had to put pills like the boys. Snort coke like the boys. Blow up the boys. People wonder why I'm such a fuck up. Yes. This. 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 That. That isn't normal. No one gives a shit. I give a shit. What do you want from me? I want to help you. Why? Because I know what it's like when you've got no one there to protect you. I love my virginity, Miss Offit. 